PSA, that's a public service announcement for the simple fact that I don't be having nobody name in my mouth, especially niggas though. If you have my name in your mouth, talking to another party, a person, I hope you able to back it up. And I hope you tough, way tougher than me. Cause if I hear it, I'ma slap the fuck out you. I'm about to start treating niggas like the bitches they are. A lot of you niggas bitches and been bitches and gon' stay bitches on cap head. But me, I never been a bitch on folks now. I ain't never been no bitch. I don't even play with bitch ass niggas. And a lot of you bitch ass niggas be doing bitch ass shit. So I'm just warning y'all. If you a bitch ass nigga, and you got my name in your mouth and you really don't want me to hear that you got my name in your mouth, which I always do, I'm not gonna spare you bitch ass niggas no more. I'm gonna start treating you bitch ass niggas like bitches. Yeah, like I, I tried to reach out. I really was hitting you up because I was like, bro, why the uh why you let G Herbo and them do you like that? <laughs> I was cause I was just like in the mall, I was like, damn, like this happening, like damn. So you just letting light skinned niggas just bully you and shit. I was just like, damn, like this is like just happening. And I was like thinking as it's going on, like, damn, it's happening. Like yeah. it was like that. You know, something just going on, like if you get into it's like if you was in a car wreck. You can't stop it. Like as you tumbling, I'm just like, damn, the car tumbling. And a while back, G. Herbo and Southside went on the Funny Marco show. Things went left. G. Herbo threw a drink at Funny Marco and just started to get disrespectful. So Chris Brown goes on Funny Marco show next and they dropped a clip with Chris Brown. That's when G. Herbo puts out this video talking about you. And I hope you tough. And next thing you know, Chris Brown is putting up posts about, oh, it's no beef between us. and. Herbo went on Academics Instagram and said, yo, I wasn't talking about Chris. Well, who was you talking about? Because we all know that Herbo made that call behind the scenes with Chris Brown. It's like, yo, ain't no smoke, big homie. You know how the bloggers do. I'm real disappointed in Herbo for doing something like this because I expected a lot more out of dude, especially after inviting the smoke. And once you get it, you ain't want it. It just looks crazy. It just looks like an empty threat. It just looks like you had too much to drink and you just calmed down from it. And now you realize what you said and you know, it's too late to delete it because you know the internet's just going to spread it around like wildfire. But hey, it is what it is. I understand people now to get the blogs talking, then now I get their name popping by, you know, what they say and what they post, so things like that. So, you know, I get the game. It is what it is. But anyway, let me know how y'all feel about it in the comments. Y'all think that Herbo backed down from the, the Chris Brown smoke or y'all think he really was talking about somebody and I just don't know. Because trust me when I say I looked into it and Chris Brown's literally the only person that came up. Anyway, if you like the video, make sure you like and subscribe.